Welcome back. Before we went for a short break, you were asked to state the use of for in the following statement. We have been waiting for two hours. What do you finally come up with? Okay. For is used in this statement to say that an action started in the past and continues up to the present time. At this junction, we can move on to analyzing other prepositions which express relations with people. Against. Against is used in the following situations. One, where we want to say that someone does not approve of an action. Examples. A woman cannot be forced into marriage against her will. That is, if she does not approve of the marriage. Lying is against my principles. That is, I do not believe it is right. Number two, when we want to say who is harmed or affected by something. Example, he was charged with crime against humanity. Number three, when we want to say something is not allowed by a law or rule. Examples, other medicine is not against the law. That is, it is not illegal. Nigeria does not have a law against reckless driving. That is a law prohibiting reckless driving. Number four. When we want to say who is accused of doing something wrong. Example, accusations of bribery have been made against the immediate past governor. Number four, when we want to say something touches or eats a surface. Examples, the sound of the rain drumming against my window. Your elbow brushed against my rib. Uh, as you leaned over. Number six, when we want to say who or what you are trying to protect someone or something from, example, all the children must be vaccinated against diseases such as polio. That is to protect all the children from diseases such as polio. Number seven, when we want to say someone or something is moving in the opposite direction of something, I want to know if it is safe to swim against the current. That is, in the opposite direction of current. Between. Between is used in the following situations. One, when we want to say which people or things are involved in something together, there is no obvious cooperation between the two countries. There is a private conversation between the two presidents. Number two, when we want to say which people or things get or are involved in something that is shared. Example, divide the oranges between your children among among is used in the following situations. One, when we want to say someone is with a particular group of people. Example, I always feel at home when I'm among my friend. Number two, when we want to say that many people in a group have the same feeling or opinion. Example, the spread of COVID-19 is causing panic among the citizens. This is how far we can go on this topic. I hope you enjoyed the lesson. Now it is high time you wrote down your assignment. Assignment. Form as many sentences as possible with prepositions which express relations with people and state their meanings in the sentences. For further reading, visit https colon slash slash dictionary cambridge dot org. YouTube https colon slash slash www dot youtube dot com.
I look forward to meeting you in the next class. Happy learning experience. Bye.